Russian media reported that, in addition to TRLG-230 systems, Turkey also sent T-122 Sakarya rocket artillery to Ukraine. Accordingly, last weekend, a battery of four T-122 launchers was seen in the Dnipro area. However, there has not been any confirmation from Ankara about the delivery of this rocket launcher to Kiev. If the information is correct, it could have a huge impact on relations between Russia and Turkey. Currently, Turkey and Ukraine have not commented on the information published by Russian media. The T-122 Sakarya is a multiple launch rocket system developed by the Turkish defense company Roketsan. Prototypes appear in 1995. In 1996, the first system were delivered to the army for testing. In 1997, the T-122 Sakarya began mass production. The T-122 Sakarya is designed to carry out missions to destroy enemy life force, military equipment, command and control headquarters. It is mostly used in hit and run style attacks. T-122 Sakarya can operate day and night in all weather conditions. The T-122 is essentially a variant of the BM-21 Grad. It inherits the advantages of the BM-21, but also has upgrades to increase combat performance. Even the T-122 is capable of firing the ammunition of the BM-21 system. Maximum firing range is up to 40 km. There are two packs of 122mm lot tubes. Each pack contains 20 lot tubes. The launcher is hydraulically traversed and elevated. The T-122 Sakarya fires rockets indigenously developed and manufactured by MKEK and Roketsan. Rockets are fitted with high explosive fragmentation and cluster warheads. The last mentioned contains anti-personnel or anti-tank submunitions. It is equipped with a state-of-the-art fire control system, which calculates firing data automatically for rockets with different warheads and is capable of storing up to 20 target coordinates. The vehicle can fire rockets singly or in several, with a full 40 rocket lot taking less than 80 seconds and blanketing a target area of 500 meters times 500 meters. In addition to later versions of the T-122 features an integral hydraulic crane which allows reloading of rocket ports within 5 minutes. Earlier production model is based on the German MAN 26281 heavy truck. It is fitted with a roof-mounted 7.62mm machine gun. There was also a version based on the MAN 26372 truck. Improved variant of the T122 was revealed in 2005. It was based on a new MAN 6x6 tactical truck. The same military truck was also used as the larger vehicle for the T-300 Kasurga. The truck can be fitted with add-on armor and NBC protection system. This truck is also fitted with the roof-mounted 7.62mm machine gun. It is noteworthy that the T-122 Sakarya multiple launch rocket systems can also fire on satellite navigation, including with the help of the Russian GLONASS system provided by the Turkish side in such weapons. 
it is impossible to deliver high precision strikes. However, with an accuracy of hitting targets up to 10 meters, such strikes are very dangerous. Moreover, as part of a battery, the systems are able to work both independently and on a single instruction, which makes it possible to cover a very large area with dense fire.